Welcome Awakening Hearts, Denny Van here. Today I want to talk about the human design deconditioning experiment. And this is where you can break free from societal conditioning and reprogram yourself according to your unique human design. And have you ever felt like there was something off about the way you were living your life? Like you were following someone else's script? instead of being true to yourself. That's how I felt before discovering my human design. And it's a system that combines astrology, the I Ching, the Kabbalah, and other disciplines to help people understand their unique energetic blueprints. And according to human design theory, we are all born with a specific design that determines our strengths, weaknesses, and purpose in life. However, most of us have been conditioned by society and our upbringing to ignore or suppress our true nature. We've learned to conform to certain norms and expectations that don't necessarily align with who we really are. That's why I decided to embark on a deconditioning experiment using waking state hypnosis. The idea was simple, create a space where my conscious mind can relax and let go of old patterns while my subconscious mind could receive new programming aligned with my human design. Waking state hypnosis is different from traditional hypnosis because it doesn't require you to be in a trance-like state. Instead, it uses guided visualization techniques to help you access deeper levels of consciousness while remaining fully aware and alert. During my experiment, I worked with self-hypnosis to help me create my healing team and visualize myself as an empty vessel ready to receive new information. And through deconditioning, integration, and affirmations that reinforced my authentic self-expression according to my specific human design type, I'm a manifester. The experience was both liberating and challenging. It required me to confront some deep-seated fears around not being accepted or understood by others if I showed up as myself without apology or explanation. But it also gave me permission to embrace my unique gifts and talents without feeling guilty or ashamed and to stop playing small. After a few sessions, I noticed significant shifts in my energy and behavior. I felt more confident and assertive in expressing my needs and desires using my manifestor strategy. I also became more aware of how certain people or situations triggered me into old patterns or behavior that no longer served me. This created an opportunity to integrate what was coming to the surface. The deconditioning experiment using waking state hypnosis has grown. We started with manifestors and now work with all energy types to help them decondition and reprogram by setting up their own self-directed healing team. It's a powerful tool for integrating human design knowledge into daily life. It helped me reprogram some limiting beliefs and behaviors that were holding me back from living authentically or by playing small. If you're curious about exploring and experimenting with your own human design type, I highly recommend giving the human design deconditioning waking state hypnosis a try. And it is highly effective in group settings. If you would like to be notified when we have our live human design deconditioning group events, reply in the comments below and we'll get you added to the list. And in the meantime, thank you for being on this amazing journey with me and keep being awesome.